I am Mindy Shire. I am a white woman with long red, actually it's usually curly, but today it's straight, <laughs> um, with a gold headband and a floral coat as my visual description. Um, but I would really love the panelists to introduce themselves, so. My name is Ursula Tadaro. I am the Director of Launch and Innovation at VS & Co. I am Lydia Smith. I'm the Chief Diversity Officer at VS & Co. Hey everybody, I am Kanye Sesser. I have no legs. I am an Asian woman and I am a skater. I have a long wavy black hair and no legs, no limits. My name is Misty Diaz and I am a consultant and model. Hi everybody, I'm Tamara Mena and I'm a bilingual content creator, model, and speaker. K let's talk about sexuality. That's been something that's been difficult for me, even though I have been paralyzed for 17 years. Yes and Co. and the transformation that we're taking is right exactly in line with that. We are trying to deliver product that allows her to be sexy for her. I would love to know, what was your aha moment on this journey? The, the lack of um, adaptive products in the intimate space prevented intimacy between him and his wife. Um, can we talk about dating? Problem, you know, dating, it was the intimacy part that it was like, okay, this is going to either go, he's going to work with me here or this is going to end right here. Or eight times out of ten, it would kind of end and that was on my, my end. It was always me overthinking that, oh, he's going to judge, oh, he's going to be upset, he's going to assume... Love Cloud was the first campaign that you included women with disabilities. And I am really excited to say that we have one of the women in the audience. Woo! Where's Miriam? There she is. What was it like to be one of the first models with a disabilities in a Victoria's Secret campaign? Probably the coolest thing I've ever done. What does it feel like to see more women or people with disabilities in general in ad campaigns, in television shows. It hit home where I was like, wow, that person looks, that person has the same crutches I do. Like, wow. And it was just, it brought tears to my eyes. I mean, it still does. Let's talk about the importance of companies to really get people with disabilities included in the workforce. We need more voices and more representation sitting around that table because that's what goes into the ideas that ultimately become the products and the things that you experience. And I'm really, really proud to work for a company that's doing it the right way with the right partner. How can I feel more confident in lingerie? Love yourself, start there, do things for yourself especially, and know that you are worthy of unconditional love, always. I, I do always like to end our sessions with, with something for the audience to go home with. It's really important that we normalize disability, and I can't wait for our community to continue shining and growing.